Hello everyone, welcome to another Exchange 2019-2013 coexistence video and we're continuing with part 8 uh, <clears throat> where we last did .NET 4.8 and in this video we're going to be doing UMC, UCMA runtime 4 and then obviously the two Visual C++ binaries. So I'm going to start with this one and it's actually a quick installation. Now you may be wondering, there's no UCMA or Unified Messaging in 2019, why do I still need to install it? Well, it's required, so you need to install it. You can't leave it out or else the setup won't allow you to continue. <coughs> so, pretty much looks the same as 2013. And it's pretty quick with this installation as well. Now you can get obviously like the UCMA f installation from um, the actual ISO file, which I'll show you in a minute once this is done. Right, and we are almost done. Okay, installation is complete. Now we're going to do the first Visual C++, which is the 2012 one. And then we will do the 2013 one. Now to show you inside the ISO, <coughs> you do have um, everything inside here. It's you can see there's the actual folder with the install file. Now obviously we, we didn't do a core installation because you can you have to run the setup from you know from core so it's easier just to have all the files within the ISO. But we will do a core installation later on. So now that we've done with UCMA4 and the two Visual C binaries the next step would be obviously to prepare AD and to prepare schema because we're introducing server 20, uh, sorry, Exchange 2019. So in the next video, which will be part uh, D of part 8, we will then be doing that. And then on the final part, we'll be doing um, the Exchange unattended installation. So I'm going to reboot. So I will see you in the next part. Thank you very much for watching.